So you have duplicate values in a single cell, but you want to remove them. Well, let me show you a simple and quick way for this. Now, if you look at this data here, I have names in each cell for the each day, but some of these names are in duplicate. So if I show you in the first day, the day one, I have this name Benny here, and I also have the same name at the end of the you know cell. And then for the day four, I have this name Sandra, and then again I have the name Sandra. Now I want to have these names without duplicates. So for this, I'm going to use a formula and this formula is a combination of three functions and these functions are text, split, unique and then text join. So these are the three functions that I'm going to use and just let me, all right, so let me start off with entering text split function that allows me to split this, you know, these names into an array using a delimiter. So delimiter is the comma and space. So I'll specify the delimiter here, that's comma and space as I said and the moment I hit enter, you can see I have these names in an array because I'm using dynamic array so I get all these names in different cells. So let me just show you, I have this name Benny here and again at the end. And when I use unique function, let me enter it here. When I use unique function and in the second argument, let me specify true for the column. Now I only get the name Benny only once. So there is no duplicate. Now, my initial task is done, but I need to combine these names once again. So for this, I'm going to use the function text join, which is exactly opposite of text split. And in the first argument, I need to specify the delimiter. And that's again a comma and a space and true for blank values. And I have the text already from the unique and text split function. Now my formula is complete and the moment I hit enter, you can see I get all the names in a single cell without duplicate name. And let me just drag this formula down and you can see even in the day four, I have Sandra only once. And if you don't have these functions in your Excel version, you can use a custom function that I have built using a VBA code. And for this, you just need to enter this function called unique list specify the cell and then again in a simple way you need to specify the delimiter that you want to use you know using these double quotation marks and close the function and it will only return the unique names in the cell now if you want to use this custom function you just need to go to your developer tab and then click on visual basic and here you need to enter this code that I have already written into the module. And if you don't have module here, you just click on insert and click on module and it will enter a new module for you. And then just like the code I have here, you just need to go to your new module and paste the code here. And you can download this sample file from the link in the description. So make sure to download and try it yourself. And if you have any problem while using this custom function, make sure to share that feedback with me in the comment section as well and i'll see you in the next video